Oh, hello everyone. I accidentally locked myself up in the attic again. It's been about a week now, and thought as well as I was up here, I might as well just go ahead and rifle through some junk. Uh, oh, yeah, take for instance this. Uh, this is an old doll we have, and it actually kind of creeps me out. It, sometimes it's like laughs in the middle of the night, and it moves from chair to chair. I'm pretty sure it's possessed, so I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of this. There we go. Oh! Take a look at this! Look, I told you, this joke is getting old. We're, we're done with this, okay? Alright, that, that was season one, this is season two. New jokes. Okay, I'm getting rid of you. Alright. Oh, hi. Take a look at this! This is my old photo album. I've, I've been taking pictures of every video I do and just... You know... As long as we're up here, we might as well take a look at a few of these. Go back to past memories. So here's the uh, Seth Lewis photo album. Boy, there sure are a lot of good memories. Oh, like, remember that one time when I covered myself in baby powder and put red marker all over my face? Okay, number one, baby powder. It is said that women love the smell of baby powder. So I would just suggest just going ahead and just spraying as much of this stuff as you can on yourself. <coughs> okay. Yeah, you feel that? It's getting steamy up in here. Very smoky. Okay, on to tip number two. Oh, it is really hot up here. Uh, I was just uh, rifling through some of these uh, these episodes, and well, I think there might be a troll or some rats up here. I keep hearing noises. Still don't know where they're coming from. Oh, but hey, do you remember this moment? Yo, before I begin this next rap, I feel I have some explaining to do. This is the story of a real flying frog known as the Flying Frog of Ugali. I wrote this rap for him when I was a kid, so here it goes. I'm the flying frog of Oogala. I got a neat little job working nine to five. I'm delivering mail from state to state with my little green arms and my little green legs. What? Oh, what's all this talk? You look like you never ever seen a rapping frog. Yeah, I be hopping around, snatching up flies, people pulling up and gasp as I soar through the sky. Oh. Red cape and blue cap. Trudging along with my big brown sack. Hard to believe that a frog from the swamp could grow up to work for the postal service. They say I don't exist until I drop off the mail at their doorstep. And then I fly away, another letter delivered for the day. An amphibious MC. Mail carrier. They call me the bug-eyed wonder. It ain't easy being green, yo. You know, the one thing about this show is it always seems like I'm getting hurt. Uh, like, like, take for instance this episode. And stop! Oh, 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 oh! Can't breathe! Oh! Okay. I've been worshipping that deer head for the, uh, last past couple of days. I mean, there's nothing else much to do. I... I know what you guys thought earlier, that that was just my foot hitting a teacup, but that wasn't what that was. That was like a raccoon or a troll or something. I'm, I'm scared. Don't question the reality of this video, okay? It's real. I'm gonna die. All right. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, hey, this was one of my favorite videos. Okay, so moving on to the next tip. Okay, so if you got a book like this, and you got some scissors like this, and you cut the book in a certain way and in a certain area, eventually, you should come across something that looks like this. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. I almost held the book upside down. That would have been a mistake I would have regretted for the rest of my life. You should come across something that looks like this. See, it says Steelers. Okay, anyways, moving on to the next tip. For this next episode, the How to Make Yourself Invisible one, I actually got the idea from a cartoon show. I think it was Tom and Jerry. Never did figure out how to make rocket shoes, though.
Hi guys. It's me. I know you all can't see me right now. You probably only see a blue wall. But I'm actually standing right in front of you. Uh, I've poured invisible ink all over my head, all over my hands. I've even poured some on my clothes. And here, let me give you guys an idea of where I am. See, woo! See, this isn't a flying and talking handkerchief. This is actually me. See, here's where my hands would be, and here's where my head would be. Anyways, I, I, I mean, I, it's kind of weird because whenever I look in the mirror, I actually see myself. And the reason behind this is that invisible people can actually see other invisible people. So anyways, I'm just tickled pink about all this. I can't wait to play some practical jokes on my friends, on my family. Hey, I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, well, that is the end of the Seth Lewis photo album. And this is usually the part in the video where someone comes and rescues me and gets me out of the attic. And... No, no, that's not happening. Okay, so I'm just stuck up here. Alright. We'll see you all later. I uh, guess this is the end. I'm gonna die up here. Wonderful.